It is Friday, December 16th. Say good morning. Good morning on biscuits. Oh, that's, that's really excited. We're excited. So this is what I'm looking at right now. This needs to go in the car. This needs to go in the car. That needs to go in the car. I'm taking grapes for the road. I'm going to fill that water bottle up. That's my purse. Um, look. That needs to go in the car, 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 and that needs to go in the car. Then, on top of all of that, I still have to take a trip to my mom's house to pick up two bags that she's taking, and then I am driving over to my sister's house, who's also going to give me a bag of things to give to my family. So, um, I am going close by, the hour is about four hours, I'm going to... Uh, stop by at Walmart to get groceries before I cross. Uh, we are from a border city, so um, it's only like like a, maybe six hour maximum whole like travel experience to get there. So um, that's why I'm taking so many things because I'm taking them in my car and um, we haven't gone. And we usually my family is like takes the opportunity and I forgot to mention that when I went to Sacramento before I came back and started came back and started vlogging I actually brought two pots because I drove up there as well uh, from one of my aunts who's also <laughs> so who's also delivering them to uh, my family in Mexico say hello is how you load there's actually room here still that's gonna be for the three additional bags that I'm gonna go pick up I and Mr. CJ, I'm so exhausted. Are you going to sit in the front? <laughs> yes, you're going to sit in the front with me because we need to load all that stuff. So I have all my personal luggage. These are all just things with the exception of that bag. It's still my personal stuff. Everything else is pretty much going to be given away. So when I come back, majority of that luggage will be back here. So, yeah, I am excited. And when you sit in the rearview mirror, um, I can still see. So that was something that I really wanted to make sure that I didn't block. I accomplished it, so I feel good about this. And I did all of that in, I don't know if you can tell, right there, right there, but look, it is raining. You're gonna go throw that in the dumpster? Yeah. All right, let's do that, let's do this, let's do this. So I was gonna do a majority of this packing when we got home. Okay, so as I was saying, it was crazy people looking at me. My neighbors were like, what is this crazy girl doing with the camera? outside um i was gonna pack everything last night but it was pouring rain i was still like okay the rain's probably gonna die down around seven eight i don't even care if i start loading it at nine one by one by myself while mr cj sleeps like at least get a good head start at least with some of the stuff that i knew was like i was done packing or anything but it poured all night long even this morning like just right now it literally just stopped raining so i woke up extra 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 early to um, put a load because I didn't even wash the the clothes that I wanted to yesterday. It wasn't really clothes. It was mostly my blankets. I just wanted to take them clean so that they can last the two weeks. And then when I come back, I can just wash them. And I was going to do that last night as well. So, like, I, I actually left to work early. I took Mr. CJ to get a haircut. And, like, I was going to have an evening of, like, just, you know, preparing and, like, finishing up last minute things. And it was pouring rain. So, I was like, forget this. I'm going to have to do everything in the morning. And it's... It had shown that it wasn't going to rain as much, so I knew I was going to get a little bit of sprinkling, but it did start raining a little hard, and I was like, oh my god, I'm going to have to load, I don't have another option, I'm going to have to load this in somewhat rain, but luckily it stopped, so we're good to go, we just got to take our laptops, and then just do a rundown, oh, my hair dryer, how can I forget my hair dryer, look, it's out there, oh, does this ever happen to any of you? Look at this rain. <laughs> <laughs> um, can you get that and well, then we'll be good to go. So this is what the weather looks like. I'm on my way to my mama's house. Yeah, it looks like I think one last pour of rain is going to happen. But I decided to just leave the house now and get a good head start. And I prefer just to drive slower. So I can still get over there at a reasonable amount of time. But I mean, that's so sad. But at least it's not raining. Maybe by the time I drive, it stops raining where I'm at two hours in and it'll rain here. That would be great.
They, oh, look at that. What shoes are you wearing? Jordan. Hey. So we made a pit stop. We were at Walmart. And, and we're going to get some good stuff to go. I'm definitely getting my my food to go. And we're going to get toilet paper because, you know, your girl's going to need toilet paper. Vaccine again. This is my dilemma now. This whole thing is full. And these are the groceries I bought. <laughs> so I got to make this fit in here. <sighs> So all of this stuff was in my car. Can you believe that? Big enough for the both of us. No, it's not big enough for the both of us. No one gets to look at my password. We're gonna chill. We're gonna chill. I'm gonna try to organize all this stuff. Good morning, home school. Say hello. Say hello. Say hello. Liga. Ya desayunamos, me pusieron a limpiar aquí la cocina. La Lorena. Mm. Y tía. Qué triste. La familia más triste. La familia más triste. La, la va a subir al YouTube para que la conozca todo el mundo. ¿Qué pasó? Oh, ya va. Y felicidad. We came to the cemetery to see. I'm gonna show you what it, how beautiful it looks. A ver. ¿Te acuerdas? Beautiful. Yes. George. Tata Jorge. Jorge. Ponlo, papá, ponlo. Allá. Ahora sí. <risa> Feliz Navidad. Está bonito. No, she did not die in 2012. She died in 2007. You were... You're gonna get wet. A ver, allá ven con tu tía. When my, when my nana died. 2007. 2007. Siete, cuando nació él. She was supposed to be born 1827. No, she was born 1936. But how? My nana said she was born 1827. What nana? My nana. She was not born. She lied to you. Uh, uh, uh. Dancing in the cemetery. Dancing in the cemetery. Te vas a mojar. Can I vlog? So we're gonna head out to just sing our that's goodbye. I don't get to come out here too often and visit my grandfather, my grandmother, and my uncle. I know, well, we don't live close by. We'll make an effort to come more often. But, you know, so that's why we're taking advantage of the trip. We're here, so we always gotta take advantage of the fact that we're gonna come and see them and just kind of reflect on life. <laughs> Um, but it's one of the most beautiful cemeteries. I love this because it's so colorful and it just It makes you happy more than anything. I mean, obviously I think about sad moments. I mean happy moments and get a little bit sad, but overall It's so pretty and even just walking around and seeing all the decorations and how much effort people still put That's something that's not really seen in the US uh, So it makes me happy and I always love taking pictures because it's so colorful and so beautiful Yeah
So good. Mm. You should bring me to Mexico more often. Mm. Mm -mm. Is it good? I love this. Mm -hmm. Let them work. That's good. And uh, <laughs> I'm not gonna be putting dressing on mine. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure to follow me on all my social media at I am Lolo, and don't forget to subscribe.